So what do we got here? We got four dry pour test pads. I've also got some wet pour concrete for destructive testing. Let's break off this corner and see how it looks inside. And we can see inside it's very wet and moist. Now let's break open the center of this pad and take a look inside. The center is moist. There's no dry powder in here. And it's crumbly because that's where I was smashing with the sledgehammer. Let's check the wet pour. And you can see it's taking about the same amount of effort for me to break it up with the small sledge. It is staying together in bigger chunks though. The top is certainly harder than the dry pour. You can see it breaks up into bigger chunks than the dry pour did also. The bottom structure though is very similar to what we saw in the dry pour. The solid pieces are larger in size and thicker in size than what we saw with the dry pour. So for the first test, I'm gonna to have to give the win to the wet pour. 